Hi, I'm Garth DeAngelis, senior producer on War of the Chosen, the expansion to XCOM 2. Far from the new and gleaming city centers, there are still scars from the first invasion. These ruined cities are home to the lost and abandoned. To reclaim Earth, you will have to get opposing factions to put aside their differences to counter the strength of the Chosen. In this mission, we introduce the Reapers, sharpshooters and masters of concealment. We also have the skirmishers, who were once Advent soldiers. Now, they fight their own past. Getting these factions to work together over their mutual mistrust won't be easy. At the start of the mission, you'll have to escort representatives of these groups to a meeting. This means choosing two teams to make contact with each faction. It's up to you to make sure the rendezvous goes off without a hitch. The Reapers will send Outrider to meet your first team. Your job will be to bring her to the rendezvous point, alive. As you move towards the rendezvous point, you'll have your first encounter with the Lost. The Lost attack in large groups, but when you kill a Lost with a headshot, this restores your action. With successive headshots, a soldier can kill multiple Lost in a turn, but you'll need to pick your shots wisely and keep an eye on your ammo. The Lost are drawn to the sounds of combat, making explosives a risky choice. Each time you set off an explosion, more Lost will swarm on your position. Your second team will escort Mox, the representative of the Skirmishers. Here you'll encounter Purifiers, Advent Specialists against the Lost. You'll also discover that Mox takes a less stealthy, explosive approach to combat. You'll need to keep Mox alive to the extraction point before you're overwhelmed. The Skirmishers and Reapers don't trust each other, but they well work together to defeat a common enemy and you'll have your hands full against the Assassin. She's one of the Elders Chosen, powerful champions of the Elders sent to hunt down XCOM. Each time you encounter a Chosen, they'll have different strengths and weaknesses. The Assassin specializes in stealth and melee combat. She'll try to daze your troops before abducting and interrogating them. Get those soldiers up before they're taken. The fight with the Assassin will be tough, if you don't keep her strengths and weaknesses at the heart of your plan, you're going to come out of the fight wounded at best. And you'll need your strength because the mission's not over yet. Swarms of loss will start to appear as you fight your way to the extraction point. Keep cool. You're not going to be able to kill all of them. If you rush straight to the evac, you're going to get overwhelmed. Steady, incremental progress and understanding how to make the most of the headshot are your keys to the fight here. Remember, the Lost don't use cover and only have melee attacks. You can prioritize positioning and shot success over defensive cover and overwatch. This is a walking gunfight. Reaching the evac point will be a huge relief, but the Chosen may have one last unpleasant surprise for you, one that may affect the course of the rest of your game. Good luck, Commander.